Hi and welcome to the session. I am Asha and I am going to help you with the following question which says if a plus bx upon a minus bx is equal to b plus cx upon b minus cx is equal to c plus dx upon c minus dx such that x is not equal to 0 then show that a, b, c and d are in gp. Let us now begin with the solution. And we are given that a plus bx upon a minus bx is equal to b plus cx upon b minus cx is equal to c plus dx upon c minus dx. Now, first let us take the first two, that is a plus bx upon a minus bx is equal to b plus cx upon b minus cx. Now applying componendo and dividendo on both the sides, this can be written as a plus bx plus a minus bx upon a plus bx minus of a minus bx is equal to b plus cx plus b minus cx upon b plus cx minus of b minus cx or bx cancels out with minus bx and a with minus a. a is cx with minus cx and b with minus b. We have 2a upon 2bx is equal to 2b upon 2cx. Now 2 cancels out with 2. We have 2 with 2. And we can write it as a upon b is equal to bx upon cx or a upon b is equal to b upon c. So this implies a, b and c are in gp. And now let us take the last two terms. So we have b plus cx upon b minus cx is equal to c plus dx upon c minus dx. Now here again applying Componendo and dividendo. On both the sides, this can further be written as b plus cx plus b minus cx upon b plus cx minus of b minus cx is equal to c plus dx plus c minus dx upon c plus dx upon minus of c minus dx. This further implies cx cancels out with minus cx, b with minus b, dx with minus dx and c with minus c. So we have 2b upon 2cx is equal to 2c upon 2dx. Which can further be written as b upon c is equal to cx upon dx or b upon c is equal to c upon d. So, let this be equation number 2 and the first one be equation number 1. Now, from 1 and 2, we get that a upon b is equal to b upon c is equal to c upon d, which further implies that a, B, C and D are in GP. So, this completes the solution. Take care and have a good day.